हेलो एवरी वन एंड वेलकम बैक टू एविएशन ए टू जेड दिस वीडियो इज रियली इंपॉर्टेंट एज टूडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट डी जी सी मॉडल एग्जाम फॉर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन एंड वी विल ऑल्सो टॉक अबाउट लास्ट सेशन दैट इज सेशन टू ऑफ ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी एंड विल टेल यू वाई मेनी कैंडिडेट फेल इन एग्जाम एंड ऑल्सो गिव सम टिप्स फॉर अपकमिंग सेशन सो वॉच दिस वीडियो टिल एंड एंड इफ यू आर न्यू टू अवर चैनल दैन मेक श्योर यू सब्सक्राइब इट नाव सो लेट इज गेट स्टार्ट All right. First of all, we will talk about session two of 2020. Now we will think what to talk. See, we all know that exam was unexpected as it took very quickly, but we cannot blame DGCA and anyone for it. The DGCA does it regularly. They changes the pattern without notice, and same happened in December 2020. We all thought that DGCA will conduct examination after one month of issuing form, but they took within ten days. So those who have not prepared or filled form by thinking that they will prepare in between failed. and many who have passed have passed in border so it's really a sad incident for our field the data for session 2 of 2020 is even worse and tells the reality about our field that many candidates don't prepare before exam dates so here is the data for december session 2 of 2020 total number of models field was 20243 out of that 1394 candidates was absent 3,759 only passed, while 15,090 candidates failed in model exam of session two of 2020. That's really a worst record, and we all are responsible for it because we have not prepared in advance. So, to warn you about it, I have decided to make this video. As already, DGCA has issued public notice for flight crew, that is, exam for pilots to get CPL, PPL, and ATPL, and form fill up date is from 5th Feb. To ninth Feb, twenty twenty one. So soon they will conduct the pilot exams and will also conduct exams for AME field persons. So I think still we have enough time to prepare for it. The expected exam date is first week of March, twenty twenty one. But it is just an expectation, and we all know DGCA is very unpredictable. So it's better you should start preparing immediately. Now many student ask me, is DGCA exam tough? Simple answer is it is not tough but tricky. Tricky in sense of options, and only those candidates can answer it who have read books and understood the meaning of it. So here's the process to prepare for DGC exam, and I guarantee that if you follow it, you will definitely going to clear any module. Number one, check all the available reference books for module. We have already made a video on all available reference books, so please check it out. Link is in description. Number 2 see which are most important books here we will take an example of mod 6 which is material and hardware there are many books for it but most common books are far 9a yasa textbook titan cip shop theory and lalit gupta like this you decide which book is important and also chapters to know about it check our tips and tricks for clearing module series where we have told each and everything about it the next step is very crucial and important Number 3 read books it's really crucial and huge hard work because you physically involve yourself in it but it's very important to read line by line as question will be asked in that way The fourth step is to read again and highlight the important points and lines now how have you come to know about it for that take previous year questions paper which we have provided in our yet all ame model notes and question pdf video so download from there also join our whatsapp group to ask and solve your doubts link is already in that same video now we have already highlighted important points lines and even paragraphs next thing is to keep on revising it regularly so that we don't forget it because many models have data and which you must by heart because you cannot understand it and keep it in mind it needs to be accurate like for example what does delta denotes on voltage color of synchromet what does aa denotes melting point of aluminum and many such questions need to be by heart it number 6 make your own notes now i have seen that very few students make their own notes and rest ask for it instead of asking and even for notes be atmanirbhar yes you can make your own notes and it's really easy i know it is time consuming because i have done it but remember it is very helpful you can also refer others notes to make your notes it's completely all right now the final step or you can say last stage of preparation is to 
Number 7. Solve question so that you know your weakness and strength of that topic. Also, you analyze yourself which topic is important or which is not. Remember these 7 steps. These steps are for your success and those who try to skip it will hardly survive that is pass or will definitely fail. But it's not about passing and failure. It's about knowing the real way to study any module. We all agree the fact that we will forget the things after passing module exam. Only few students will be able to retrieve it. But we all will forget whether we have done full preparation or just solve some questions and clear the module. But the candidate who have gone through complete procedure will be able to retrieve quickly compared to others. So it's my humble request to go through genuine process and please have knowledge and understanding and then only feel the module exam. Because in bonus of this video, you will understand why I request you to fill form carefully. So please follow these 7 steps. A summary of these steps is already provided on our Instagram page in our post. Link is in description so you can keep it forever with yourself. Also, you have time of about one and a half months to prepare for exam. And I want you all to actively participate in asking and solving doubts in our module groups and other module group as well. Because if you think that you will easily clear without having knowledge, then it's wrong thinking. You might be, but it's like a gambling. Don't gamble your luck and money here. I hope you have understand the importance of preparing in advance and I wish you all good luck for it. If any doubts then feel free to ask in our comment section and yes if you are still watching then make sure you like this video and share it with our friends and here is your bonus. DGCA got 20,243 forms in just 5 days so you can actually understand that how much money they can make per session. So it's around 3 crore 3 lakh 64,500 rupees. Out of that, 1394 candidates were absent, so it's 20 lakh 91,000 free money for them. So please, if you feel the form, then give the exam. Don't waste your money unless it's an emergency, which some of you have, but still try to give exam. Then, if we calculate for past that is useful amount for candidates, it is just 56 lakh 38,500 rupees. So it's worth amount, but the failed model amount is really huge. It's 2 crore 26 lakh and 35,000 rupees. So that is total profit for DGCA as you will reappear in that failed module next session. So I once again request you all to feel the module which you think you can clear or has prepared for it because otherwise you will waste your money and most important time as again you need to go through it. We also request you all to tweet about it as DGCA must have transparent system of showing result because we don't know where we went wrong and if we all together wrote about it then we might get some solution and that we will save more money as we will have proof of answer and what we mark. And if those who think DGCA is doing right thing then comment down your views on it. Those who think it's not then write about it on Twitter and tag DGCA Ministry of Civil Aviation PMO India and Hardeep Singh Puriji. It's my humble request, we must come together for betterment of our field, instead of blaming one another, unite and fight for our right, otherwise we will be fooled by such people. That was all for today. Thank you for watching, see you soon in another video. Till then, keep learning, keep watching, stay safe, Jai Hind.